In this video, I will show you how to solve problems using trigonometric ratios. So a 25 foot ladder is propped against a wall at an angle of 18 degrees with the wall. So let's see. Here's my wall. And uh, we have this ladder that is propped against the wall. So this is going to be my ladder. And it says it's at 18 degrees with the wall. So that, that means 18 degrees between the ladder and the wall. So we'll have 18 degrees right here. Of course, this is a right angle. How high up the wall does the ladder reach? Well, that's going to be this distance right here. So that's what we're looking for. And they told us that we have a 25 foot ladder. So that means that this is 25 feet right here. So we are going to use sine, cosine, or tangent. And I like to use the acronym SOKOTOA. to remind me of the definitions of the three trig functions. Sine is opposite over hypotenuse, cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse, and tangent is opposite over adjacent. So let's label the sides. Always start with the hypotenuse, which will be across from the 90 degree angle. So this is the hypotenuse. Now, uh, circle the angle, draw an arrow away from it, you have just pointed at the opposite side. The other side is adjacent. Now, which two sides are we dealing with? We've got the 25, which is the hypotenuse, and we've got the x, which is adjacent. Those are the two sides we're dealing with. So we're not going to do anything with the opposite leg this time. So, Hmm, adjacent and hypotenuse. Which trig function is that? Well, it's going to be this one because cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. So this is going to be a cosine problem. So let's go ahead and set up cosine. So we say cosine, next comes the angle, cosine of 18 degrees. And cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. So that will be x over 25. When the variable is in, is in the top like this, you're going to solve by multiplying both sides by the denominator. So I'm just going to multiply both sides by 25. All right, that way these will cancel out. That leaves x by itself. So we have uh, 25 cosine 18 is equal to x. And this is something you can just put in your calculator. 25 cosine 18. 25 cosine 18. So that's 23.8 if we round up. Alright, and that's why the answer to this question was 23.8 feet. 